from the Barbecue Life UK, my name's Tom, and today we're doing a special cook. We're doing a collaboration with another YouTuber called Ryan. His channel is Costa La Great Missenden. If you haven't seen his channel already, make sure you check it out. I'll leave a, a link in the subscription below and I'll stick an eye card up in the top corner. So we're doing a Halloween collaboration. We're using the uh, hashtags of Halloween Barbecue and Spooky Smokers. So if you've got any cooks that you're doing yourselves, leave them hashtags on in there and then we'll be able to keep track of what you're actually doing so today we're going to make a monster burger and it's going to be fun so we've got two 80 20 patties we've got some back bacon that i've trimmed up a piece just for the large section at one end we've got some american cheese which i've already cut up to make some teeth and fangs and then some googly eyes which are pickled onions which I've cut the middle out of and then put some red pepper in the middle to make the eyes. So we're going to get the bacon frying away. So we need to keep this as flat as possible. You'll see why at the end when I start to build the burger as to what this piece is. We need to keep it nice and flat. And then we're going to add the other bacon as well, and I've got another slice which I've chopped up. So once the bacon's cooked, we're going to remove it, put it off to one side and get these burgers cooked. So we're going to move that pan away from the heat, and next we're going to toast our buns. Now these I'm quite proud of. As you can see they're green, so I've added green food colouring into the mix when I was making the buns. I've put a layer of mayo on the bottom to get us a nice toast. Now if you'd like to see uh, the bun recipe, I'm going to leave a poll up in the top corner for you to vote. So we've got a nice char on these buns, nice crisp bottom. Next up we're going to get our burgers cooked. So we're going for a direct cook directly above the charcoal nice quick cook Get second burger patty on and when the colour starts to come up the side it's time to flip nice bit of flame from that fat on the other side and when they're almost cooked it's time to get on some cheese we're going to use two different types of cheese today, so we've got cheddar cheese on one. And an American style burger cheese on the other. And we're going to close the lid and just let that melt. And once it's melted, it's time to take them off. So we're going to start building our bun. So we're going to put the burger patty with the cheese on first. Then we're going to layer on our piece of bacon, sticking out the side of the burger. Get the rest of the bacon pieces on as well. get the other burger patty on top. I've changed the camera angle so that you can have a, a better look at what we're building here. So it's a nice front row of teeth again made out of burger cheese and a couple of fangs. Crown it off with the top bun. and stick in our googly eyes. What a great bit of fun this would be to make for the kids for Halloween. If there's anything in this recipe that you don't like, then it's quite easy to swap it out. Just use your imagination. So this is a cook I've had planned 
pretty much since I started the channel back last November that I knew I was going to do a Halloween cook. It's been really nice to do a collaboration with Ryan over at Costa de la Missenden. Let's uh, give this a bite. It's fundamentally just a cheeseburger, so it ain't going to taste no different. I love the green bun. It's a good, good quirk on it. Beautiful. You see the colour all the way through. I think the key thing to remember with this cook is it's just a bit of fun. Green burger bun, when are you ever going to use it? But it added a nice, a different challenge to this burger. The amount of time I've spent making burger buns, f feeding it with thread dye so that I can make sure I get the right colour. It's been great fun. So if you like what we're doing here at Barbecue Life UK, then please do subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like the video. Uh, leave a comment underneath. If you're doing any Halloween cooks yourself, make sure you use the hashtag, hashtag Halloween Barbecue and Spooky Smokers so that myself and Ryan can keep an eye on what you're all doing. We're looking, both looking forward to seeing what you can cook. And thank you very much for watching.